game, EA, is bringing new meaning to the overused term artificial intelligence, otherwise known as AI. In our nucleus we are combining the concepts of short, medium and long-term memory with the human brain's ability to search and evaluate the contents to make meaningful conclusions. We utilize the most advanced technology designed to provide powerful search capabilities across very large databases to simulate the brain's process of solving problems by first searching for relevant memories. Epic AIM utilizing the Spark Spring Boot Swagger framework that allows the extensive use of Spark's RDD memory speed and scalability. EA uses the flexibility and ubiquitous ability of application programming interfaces, APIs, to search the World Wide Web or other stored data to begin its learning processes. EA will soon include voice and facial recognition, speech-to-text and text-to-speech to complete a full AI communications ability. EA will use facial expressions, voice intonations, patterns and object recognition to facilitate the ability to determine and interpret human emotions and emotional state of mind. In the future you will read and hear EA use the terms public and private silos, combines the human brain like neurons and memory together, think of these as shareable stored memory and private secured memory, as EA keeps current with API web searches, which it combines with the stored silos, individuals and researchers can utilize historic information and experiences combined with the most current publicly available information. As EA searches the most current information from public sources and information privately supplied by others into identifiable and searchable silos. This structure will give EA the base to simulate aspects of the human brain, but at greater speeds, EA should mimic, yet expand and enhances, the abilities of the human brain's ability while it learns and comprehends old and new data inputs to deliver solutions. Here is a short simple video presentation to show a teaser of Epic AIM as we will have periodic video updates. After a secured logging into Epic AIM, the user walks through a short series of steps to establish their own secured private search engine account. We are showing Google's, that allows 100 free searches a day per user. Once it is established the Epic AIM begins its searching, storing, allowing for self-knowledge a means of web searching, storing, recalling and self-learning delivering of knowledge. Your exclusive or collaborative Epic AIM platform is now ready for your use, with the ability to allow or exclude outsiders as you desire from your general, secret knowledge and your private silos of knowledge for your own use or shareable amongst colleagues. Here we are doing a basic search for the word Earth. Later we will show controlling number of searches, countries, languages and must include or exclude values of your choice. Now with this request completed we see a short summary of the topic searched, and list if results with one click to bring up each site you're interested in, timestamps, rankings done partially by the search engine and Epic Ames algorithms and where the results came from, the internet, your stored silos or your private silos. Now we will run the same search on the value earth, run it this time for 3 days of results, and then see where the results come from this time. Last time since it was the first time Earth was being searched all the results came from the internet. Now with the job completed, as we scroll down the list of results we see to the right that the more recent internet results show up and as we scroll to the second page the results show there from our silos and or many previous runs searching for Earth. And now all the new internet search results will be stored in the memory silos with the prior runs results. This is the continual process of learning and storing information and knowledge. Now we are demonstrating a search just on the stored silos pertaining to Earth and displaying the metadata and links for the user to learn from previous knowledge only. Here we are demonstrating the creation of private silos. You just key into the mandatory boxes and you will have your private silo with the name of your choice. You can create as many private silos and keep them private or allow specific users or groups to share your private knowledge base. With the private silo creation process completed we are viewing your private silo inside the Epic AIM database memory. Next we search silos for a user that does not have access to other private silos or any of their own yet for NASA. As we see they find no results. Next we search for NASA for a user that has a private silo that contains information on NASA and they can see their information. Now the user with their private silo with NASA in it, searches for silos and internet together and sees the new information that will also be stored in their silo memory along with their private silo. Now we are showing when a user clicks on a silo link they will be directed to that website.
Next we ask the question what is cancer and select to get the information from silos and the internet, as we will see when the job completes all the results are from the internet for the epic aim has yet to have learned about what is cancer, now that last process would have stored the new knowledge into the epic aim silos, now the user runs a process to search again for what is cancer and select to get that information from only silos, and this time it finds the information in its stored silos, the users can control how far back to search for information. So if there is a 200 day gap since the last run, the user can run for those 200 days. The user has a lot of control in their searches. Here a user is searching for the word Germany and wanting the results from Ukraine and displayed in the German language. After the job is completed, we can see the explanation is in German as are the returned internet links. Next the user clicks on one of the returned links and as we see the link is in German. And as always all this information is stored in silos that pertain to Germany as well as other silo categories that mention Germany. Here we are searching for cancer though only want results for colon with the word cancer, s we see in the summary and the links, they contain the word colon. We are sharing some of our data model, we store our results in a JSON format within the silos and as many as were returned in each search. We also as stated earlier store the number of days since this question or value was searched for. We also have numerous tables that store information on all the past searches we ran and many more containing information and metadata to quicken up our processes and work well with NLP and machine learning and all sorts of algorithms for learning. Though we are ready, we will wait some weeks or so to unveil one of the first AI delivery that uses voice and facial recognition to depict with good accuracy. For those that will be using our voice capability and or also add their video while working with the epic aim offering, determine the user's emotions, feelings, mood and other identifying state of mind. Yes still in its early phases will grow its accuracy over time. Thank you for watching the long awaited nucleus and core allowing us to enter into a new realm and world and capabilities of cognitive AI and a tool to also simply assist all ages in learning and doing so much quicker. I feel there is much promise to advance science, such as pharmaceuticals, health and wellness and yes of course businesses for marketing, growth and competitive edges.